please back up so you can have some space to breathe. First of all, congratulations, Gary, for a great fight. What are your thoughts? I won 10 rounds to two, nine rounds to three. I outboxed him. Uh, hurt my arm. I, I knew my arm was hurt coming into the fight. You know, uh, I already stated that I had an injury coming in. I just didn't want to reveal what the injury was. Um, caught a slight head bump earlier in the fight. But a small thing to a giant. I still believe that I outboxed him, outclassed him, outskilled him, at least, like I say, nine rounds to three, ten rounds to two, hands down. Did, did you have to go to a play after the injury, like a plan B, plan C kind of thing? Um. It wasn't even a plan B, plan C type thing. It was more so that I knew that my skill set was just much more superior than his. You know, he couldn't hit me. I was able to land my shots at will whenever I wanted to punch. I was able to control the real estate when I wanted to. Uh, if he wanted to fire any shot, I would slide in, smother him, uh, take away any type of effective shot that he attempted to try to throw. Um, my ring generalship and everything, my boxing IQ, it spoke for itself. What, I wonder what the fans got to say about this. I wonder what the fans got to say about what the judges is saying, you know, because I'm pretty sure a lot of the fans would disagree. Were you surprised at the um, decision when they announced it? Of course I was surprised at the decision. You know, uh, I'm a warrior at the end of the day. I knew I had an injury. I refused to, to uh, postpone this fight after a, almost a two-year layoff. I wanted to get back in there and display my skill set. I believe that I did so with one arm. Yeah with a, a tough opponent, and you know, like I say, 10 rounds of two, nine rounds of three, hands down. Yesterday we talked about you never being 100% when you step into the ring. Mm -hmm. But do you regret now coming to the fight that injured, that compromised? Um, no, I don't regret it, because I got an opportunity to show the fans what I can really truly do. You know, I'm a real champion at the end of the day. You know, I don't regret it, you know, um, I think it's going to be a lot of fans that's going to be disappointed at the decision, you know, and the way that the judges has, has called this, this thing. Um, but it's also going to be a lot of people that's going to be like, hey, Gary is definitely the truth. You know, I, I truly believe I won the fight, like I say, nine rounds of three, ten rounds of two. He couldn't touch me. You know, the little scars that I possibly got on here, this was the head bunt. He landed maybe two solid clean shots, for real, for real, in the entire fight that I can honestly think of. Um, I outboxed him, I outpointed him, I outclassed him the whole way through. If and when you face him again, what will you be able to do healthy? Oh, healthy, I'm gonna beat that ass even worse than what I did tonight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Man, we, we definitely trying to see if we can get a rematch. Of course, I'm gonna I go and get this thing figured out. It was an injury that uh been haunting me for a long time. Uh, before the 2008 Olympics, I had a torn tendon in it and they wanted me to go and do surgery. I refused to go and get surgery and go under the knife. They told me that I was able to uh, strengthen the muscles around it to actually protect it. That's what I was able to do throughout the duration of my career. Um, and I heard it two weeks into, well, two weeks out from today. You know, um, if you actually pay attention to some of my interviews, you can actually probably see me wearing a sling in some of my interviews. Uh, this little white thing across my shoulder. I was. I was real careful about you actually being able to see my arm in the sling, but you can see the little white thing across my shoulder in some of my interviews that I've done. you can't get the rematch, what's that? Like, what do you go? Do you stay at 26? Do you go up? Uh, man, I go up. I go up. I can fluctuate. I, like I said, I was always willing to move up and fluctuate my weight, you know, as long as we was able to compete against the champion, you know. Some of the some of the best they they had adversity. What's life without adversity? If you can get anybody, in the, question, guys. if you can get anybody in the ring, moving up, who would it be? Same people I've been wanting: Javante Tank Davis or a rematch with Vasily Lomachenko. Why do you think you didn't get the nod? Last question. Last question.